Hey guys. Y'all. It's Monday evening. Well, whatever. It's 7.33. Still daylight out. So how's everyone doing? These kids are always in the street. You would think they would just give them a slab of something. Not to play in the street. I think sometimes when you're looking for a house, consider if you have children and if your basketball goal has to be in the street. And if your HOA is going to say something. Which ours does. It talks about it. To why the hubby wants to move. <laughs> to have to live in the country, have two or three acres. Well, I always wanted that. It ain't have nothing to do with the HOA. She wanted this house. I, I could have waited and kept saving, getting it right. I want a lake. It's all my fault. It ain't fault. You just, you got a lot of decisions to be made. Your husband know what I'm talking about. Make the decision, paint the door. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> we are not finished. <laughs> you still talking about this door that I ain't finished. I finished the door, but not the uh, trim of the door needs to be done but yeah so how's everyone like i said we did um a video did go up this weekend about our blended family it was a two-part series so it went out saturday and sunday um because it was 40 minutes long and it actually was very difficult to edit even in a two-part so i'm gonna have to break down probably next month and get a new phone that way this phone will strictly be for vlogging um, and then the other one will be just you know for everything else because I literally have to delete everything off the phone in order to get videos out if it's over a certain amount of time for like the video then so when are you when are you gonna be done with the song because you said Monday is Monday I'm waiting on you, Mr. No, I told you. I already recorded the music. Oh, you did? You, you said I told you. I said, hey, we're going to record the music. You can put your headphones in through your laptop and record. And I was going to put it over. What? Okay, y'all. Y'all heard that? Now I see a recording artist. I'm just trying to help you out for real. I feel. told her I was going to take them to the studio. Ah, we ain't got to do that like no that. No studio. We ain't got to do that like that. do recording stuff. I was gonna put it down. We, we gonna get it right. So currently we're heading to real quick to the storage um, to get some stuff out that he needs for practice. And he's gonna go by Publix because he's on the hunt for a specific tortilla chip. <laughs> he's <laughs> bougie, y'all. Like he don't want the the tors What is it? Tostinos the mini rounds because they're not big enough and he don't like the triangle size tortilla I like chips because like he want to make nachos oh that's the that's the word that nacho. I, so i've searched a couple walmarts that don't have oh, them it's so you said it was i thought it was supposed to be open this in the summer so we're getting a library right down the street praise jesus because we do a lot of things at the library like with the track club because they let you rent um not rent they let you utilize the conference rooms and stuff like that so we have like all our parent team meetings there educational classes um but there's getting one right there so that would be nice to be able to book that one, of course, is not as big as the one we go to, but hey, it's a start. And when my niece and nephew, when 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 Rona is gone, you know, I can like take them straight down the street versus every time I say I'm gonna take them, it's like 20 minutes away from the house. Well, she really means our nephew. Yeah, my niece don't like to learn nothing unless it's something to eat. <laughs> So, are you going to pull this first? So, you want to get the seaweed while you're here? I'm not getting out. So, we got in a 
homemade sushi maker. Uh, so we're gonna be starting to do sushi rolls at home. But Walmart was out of the seaweed um, that we needed to, you know, to make them. But the sushi kit came in today and I'll show that when we get back home. I got a DIY project that I'm gonna try to do if I like this shower curtain that I ordered. You mean if you like it? I ain't opened it yet. Isn't it the one you liked when you ordered it? It looked a whole lot vib more vibrant online than <laughs> when you get it here. It's almost like, was well, that really gold or is that like mustard color? I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to kind of put it contrast against the stuff that we have. But if I do the DIY, I we'll would definitely do a separate video about that. So are you going to do roll call? Hey, y'all. I'm trying to get this roll call thing together. But I do want to send a shout out to LC. How you doing, brother? Enjoyed the, I guess you would call it snippet that Miss Sasha allowed us to see. <laughs> I think it was two Sundays ago you went and did it, brought the message. Oh, yeah, he was preaching, yeah. Oh, was it? Oh, yeah, it was like last Sunday or was, I don't know what date, um, if her videos are in order based on like currently. But oh, I thought you was on the one day, but. <laughs> you know what? But yeah, it was good to hear the little bit of sermon that we did get to hear. Um, it would be nice. If your church, um, I will include our church's uh, Facebook page, but if you guys, not Facebook, or YouTube channel, but if your church has a Facebook or YouTube channel and they're doing like Wednesday night and Sunday sermons still online, comment below and that way we all could, you know, check it out. Cause I like listening to different preachers um, and not just my own, um, you know, that do different sermons dur during the week. But yeah, because yeah, Elsie, you reminded my you, wife of her dad. Yeah, and I said, oh, the Pentecostal, I don't know. You might, well, my dad was Pentecostal, and that's what it reminded me of. But you might have been Southern Baptist. I'm not really sure. Yeah, I said, oh, look at Elsie getting the hoop, finna get hooping <laughs> up in here. And he's loud with oh, the window I'm, down. I'm, I'm sorry. Get ex I got excited to like, Elsie. I understand. Yeah. Believe me. She trying to be all embarrassed. Nah, you just loud. That sounded kind of ratchet. So you see out, out the window. No, I ain't screaming out the window doing that. And got people good. looking at me. You good to look at, baby? I don't know. Oh, you you so good all the time. Tell nobody how the hell look. I still love you. <laughs> I still love you. He's gonna run in Publix, and I'm gonna be right here in the car. We'll come it's back. Take about 15 minutes, man. You know. I'm Oh, guys, hey, welcome back to the channel. Real life over here. So I'm going to do a quick grocery haul. Michael um, just got home from practice and going to the grocery store. So I'm going to do this really quick. Um, start with the meats. All right, so we, he got up like the family, I guess, pack of uh, chicken wings, which are eight fifty one. dollars We've got some imitation, uh, like the crab sticks. We have um, a sushi kit, which I'll show you guys that. Um, so he just got uh, this type and the stick type. We've got some pork rinds. I, that was in one of the, the meat bags. We're gonna have steak tonight. I took out uh, chicken legs, but I just really don't feel good to cook. So we're going to cook a whole meal. I'm gonna do some Brussels sprouts and he's gonna do the steaks. So. Me and Easter eat the New York uh, strips, which you get three for 20. Angus is like the best one. Um, we got some like last week that were not Angus and they were like cheaper. What brand was that of the steaks we got last week? They don't have a brand. Well, type. Real it wasn't Angus. Oh. It was not Angus. Uh, yeah, and it was horrible horrible i guess we're kind of like steak snobs almost so he does the bone in um t-bone steak and he gets two uh for 26.61 got some all-purpose flour um you can use this when you're making the tempura batter for like the the sushi rolls that we're going to do and also i'm looking at possibly doing a pound cake sometime this week don't know when um cajun turkey 
from the belly. He got some of that. And he also got some um, honey ham and a bag of flounder. All right, so this is the last part. We got a 10 pound pack of sugar. Um, we've been making lemonade and when I do the cake, we're gonna need sugar. This is the um, sushi uh, kit that we brought off of Amazon. Um, I wanna say it was um, like $14 and it comes with two mats, uh, the little paddle, all, everything you need. We've got some chopsticks in here. So it wasn't bad. Um, and Michael went to the Asian store and you do go to the store, I tell you. Oh, not just go to the store. Oh. You do it all. Um, I don't know. So we got some seaweed uh, wraps uh, for the sushi. This is um, 500, uh, is it five? No, 100 sheets. <laughs> I saw 500 and I was like, it's 500 sheets in here? We can eat that much sushi. But it was $22 for 100 sheets where we couldn't find it in Walmart. It kept saying they sold it, but it was always sold out. And I want to say the package was only like eight sheets or something that the store would have had. So we went to the Asian store. Pete did anyway. He got some eel sauce, which they call it um, Ugandi sushi sauce. I don't know why everybody else calls it eel sauce, but he got some of that. He got from Walmart. He finished this some distilled water for his nebulizer machine. Got some uh, butter, some cream cheese, some of the matchstick um, carrots for the sushi. Got a gallon of milk and some vegetable oil store he spent $26 oops $26 and 48 cents at Walmart he spent a hundred oops there it is $155.69 on our visa all right guys I'm gonna roast some Brussels sprouts I'm gonna be cutting them into four since they're so large I'm cutting up an onion and bacon. I'm going to be adding pepper, olive oil, kosher salt, and I have some balsamic uh, glaze that I'm going to do midway of the cooking process. We had steaks that night. I had told Michael that I wanted him to film the steaks, but he did not. So I apologize, but thanks for watching, guys. Till the next one.